Hello everyone, welcome back in today's tutorial on Informatica MDM. In today's tutorial, we are going to see some more important properties about match and merge. On few of my videos on YouTube, I come to know the users or the 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 watchers have more questions about the accept limit, geocode radius, and match weight. So I thought I should prepare another video with more detail on this property. So let's start today's session. So what are these properties? What are these uh, accept limit adjustment and geocode radius properties? So these properties are related to the match process. So if you make any changes in these properties, it will have the impact either positive or negative based on the property values on the match process. So let's start the uh, let's have a deep dive in these properties. So where can we configure the geocode radius and the accept limit adjustment properties? So whenever we configure the match setting, we configure the match properties, the path, match columns, and then we finally try to create the match rules in the match rule sets tab. Whenever we start to create any fuzzy match rule, then you will get this kind of pop-up where we have to provide what is the match and search strategy that is for example here it is fuzzy then we have to provide the match purpose whether it's a person it's a individual or it's an organization or it is address then we have to provide the match level typical conservative and loose etc and then there are two properties that is called as geocode radius which is in meters and the accept limit adjustment which is the integer property so in the bottom section we provide the match column such as person name address line one address line two city state etc so this is the section or this is the dialog pop-up where we have to provide these match related properties so what is geocode radius it is the property which is used for the fuzzy base object if you remember fuzzy base object is nothing but the base object which is declared as a fuzzy we can declare a base object as exact as well so if you declare the any base object fuzzy then this geocode property or geocode radius property will be available to use this property helps when we want to identify records that lie within the specified radius so suppose you want to match the record which have the address within the five miles or within the two miles you can use this property the geocode radius field is enabled if you select the geocode field name for the match column. So for example, if you use the geocode property for the match purpose or the address as a match purpose, then you can choose one of the column for the geocode field matching. Then we can specify the geocode radius. Of course, this is in meters. For example, if you want to search the record or if you want to match the record in the five mile ra five mile radius, then you have to convert that five miles into the meters and mention this property in the meters. For example, when the records are closed, suppose the what are the diagram we have shown that the big circle is nothing but that's a radius within which we want to match the addresses. And the small one that is A and B are nothing but the actual addresses. So if the address are, are closer within that specified radius, so that means when the records are close to the geocode radius that you specify the match score are higher. That means the addresses are going to match with high score. In the reverse case, within the specified radius, if the addresses are far apart or, or they are located away, then the match score is low so there are less chances of matching such addresses so these are the two uh, scenarios where the match impact or the match scenario differs so define based on your the what is the geocode radius or the, what is the geocode locations within which you want to match the record based on that the match score will be generated and the records will be matched accordingly Suppose you have the two uh, for if I if I want to give the other uh, geocode radius location example, then I can give this example. Suppose you have the banks, two branches which are located in the same city. 
and if they are closer if within the same radius it is very easy to match those two bands uh, for the that given bank record but if they are fall fall means if those branches are far apart or they are located at a uh, far distance then we can say these two branches are completely different rather than it is the same branch for example if you don't give the street address for one uh, street address for the one bank and if you give the street address for the second bank it will try to identify the match record whether those two records for the same branch of the bank or these are completely different branches by using this geocode radius property some of the questions where will be geocode radius value stored so this is more technical questions may be asked in the interview so as this is a property it must have persistent state that means it must have saved in somewhere in the database of course this is saved in the column called as geocode radius which is available inside the c repos match rules so if you open the c repos match rule database table you will find this column and the value will be populated based on the what are the value we are going to specify in this property can we use geocode radius for the exact base object the answer for this question is no we cannot use the geocode radius property for the exact base object column or exact base object it is the fuzzy base object property let's have a look on the second important property that is accept limit adjustment what is this property this is very important property accept limit is a number that determines acceptability of the match suppose you got the two match score which match score should we accept or suppose we have the three record one two and three one match with the two with the 50 percent match score two and three match with the suppose 40 percent so what is me uh, what is accepted limit suppose you want to accept all the record which have the match score more than 50 or the accept the match score which is having the more than 30 so something like that this is the same as a match level if you see the match levels are the three properties conservative lows and the typical accept limits also work on the same line or it also work same as a match level but it is little more granular so accept limit works at the granular level accept limit is defined by the informatica within the populations in accordance with its match purpose so if you change the match purpose for example current match purpose is individual and if you change from the individual to the organization this accept and limits will be different in the population so as your match purpose changes the accept limit adjustment will happen remember accept limits work exactly same as the match per match level important things if you make a positive adjustment in the match uh, in the accept limit it will result in conservative matching so there will be less number of matches will be found if you use the positive numbers if you use the negative numbers then it will be more ne loser matches so you will find more matches in your match result adjusting the accept limit even a few points suppose you change from the two value from two to three there will be dramatic effect in the match results so we have to make sure this value is optimum so in order to determine that appropriate value you have to run the match job with the adjusting this value a couple of times if you change this value from slightly from the lower to higher or higher to lower you may come across the over matching or the under matching similarly if you use the typical if you use a conservative or if you use the loose matching how the matches are differ because the differ or dramatic matches will be found so make sure you are using this property vitally here is the example of accept limit accept limit for the typical match level is 80 for the lows match is 70 for conservative match is 90 if you specify the positive number for example 3 uh, for the adjustment then the accept limit becomes slightly more conservative as I mentioned if you put the positive value less number of matches that is conservative matching if you provide negative that's loser uh, will be the matching so the more value more matches will be found 
let's have a look on the match weight okay so we so far we have seen the two properties geocode radius which is mostly related to address for the up more appropriate matching then we saw the accept limit which is uh, going to give us more conservative or more loose matches that is like if you want to achieve the if you if you come across the over matching or the under matching you can tweak this property and the third property is match weight where can you find the match weight match weight again it's a match related property you can f uh, use this match weight in the match columns in the match rule setting here i have highlighted this match weight button with yellow color so suppose you have the multiple columns such as person name you have the address part 1 address part 2 or if you have the ss and exit column you can use the any particular column and you can give the more weightage to such column for example if you are using person name and address part 1 and your match purpose is suppose individual then you have to give the more weight to the per person's name so if the per person's name is matching more then we can slightly add the address part contribution or if you are matching for the address then you have to provide the more weight on the address fields for example address line 1 address line 2 compared to the person's name so you can increase the weightage on the address part if you are using the match part different so this is the property location where you can configure the weightage it is a fuzzy column property okay so make sure your uh, column is fuzzy if it is exact column this property will be disabled for each column informatica mdm hub assigns a internal match weight for example uh, by default is 50 percent which is a number that indicates the importance of this column relative to the other columns in the table for example you have the person name you have the address name, address line one which column you want to provide the more weight that weight property nothing but this match weight the match weight varies according to the select match purpose for example if you are using individual as a match purpose then your weight will be go to the person name if you are using address then your weight will go to the address line 1 or address line 2 or more other address related properties match weight example is here if the match purpose is person name the informatic mdm hub when evaluating matches views a data match in the same column with a greater importance for example if your your match purpose is person name it will give the more weightage on the person or the party name compared to the address field and for this your match purpose is suppose address then it will give the more importance to the address and uh, less importance to the person name so that weightage we have to configure so when you select that yellow button which is i highlighted in earlier slide it will uh, the the column which is select become a bold that means we have the more weightage or more weight on the bold column so that is we can configure manually during the match rule configuration what is the use of then match weight by adjusting match weight column you give the added weight to the match column means we are enhancing the weightage of that column in the given match rule it will enhance the significance of that column related to the other column here is the example if you are putting more weight on the party name compared to the address part one for the match purpose as a person then more importance will be given to the party name rather than on the address part one during the match process so these are the details about the various important properties during the match process so we have seen the three basic and important properties those are geocode radius then we have seen the uh, accept limits adjustment to ha achieve the appropriate matching rather than over matching or under matching and the last property that is match weight to achieve the more appropriate matching i hope this tutorial is going to help you to understand this basic concept about the match and merge in the informatica mdm if you have any questions about informatica mdm you can mention in the video below Thank you for watching my video and have a nice time.